obražavamo jubilej deset godina od intenzivne saradnje sa Nacionalnom gardom Ohio. Toj saradnji smo prišli sa veoma jasnim idejama i posvećujemo im Посвечимо ја посебно пажња, па сме самим тим и могу да кажем задоволни до садашните резултати. So the reason that this partnership has lasted for 10 years and been so enduring is because it's much more than a partnership. It's really truly a friendship. And when you have friendships, then that relationship is much more at the basic level. So our soldiers and our airmen and those relationships that they have with the members of the Serbian Armed Forces are at that basic level. It really comes from the heart, and that's really what a friendship is about. Yeah, you know, the, uh, first, the first encounter actually was with uh, President Tadish and uh, General Polos, the uh, Chief of Defense, and they came here to Ohio. All we saw was opportunities. At, at the beginning, and, and it still exists today. And, and what we saw was that the Serbian Armed Forces was professionals, the Ohio National Guard was professionals, and bringing those professionals together, it was a learning environment. And so I think the initial beginning of this uh, with, with the uh, President coming here and the Chief of Defense coming here and then followed by a visit there, just set the tone for this great partnership that we still exist today. I am Lieutenant General Zdravko Pono, Chief of Defense of Serbian Armed Forces. Uh, Serbia and Ohio started state partnership program nine months ago, and we already achieved great results. These days I visited training sites here in Ohio, and I am really impressed. And that's one reason more to believe that uh, our state partnership program is going to be very successful. And uh, at the same time, I am impressed by support that you have from citizens of Ohio. That's something that uh, it's really useful and I believe that our state partnership program and joint cooperation will have full support from both our citizens in Serbia and Ohio and our politicians. Kao što je jako bitno da sastav vaše garde, nacionalne garde Ohio, u većim delom, većim delom čine civili, i to omogućava da se upredo sa razvojem vojno-vojne saradnje razvija civilno-vojni i civilno-civilni aspekt saradnje, što se svakako odražava na uspostavljanje razumevanja i prijateljstva pripadnika naših vojskih i naših građana. As I would go to the Pentagon, um, I, I talked several times to the chairman of the Joint Staff, Admiral Malda, at the time. And, and one of the questions he asked me was, how did you get everybody in Serbia wearing Ohio t-shirts, Cleveland Brown t-shirts, and, and it was just by the partnership that we had, the friendships we had, and, and the, our soldiers and airmen uh, representing us in, in Serbia. I know the friendships that have been established between not only the leadership of the Serbian Armed Forces, uh, but, but down to the individual soldier and airman level will really truly be those kind of uh, enduring relationships that uh, will carry us forward. General Ponoš and I first met, we talked about setting this up as the um, best partnership of all of them. The expectations were exceeded immensely, immensely. And that's because the soldiers and airmen that, that we had participating in it, the soldiers and airmen that the Serbian Armed Forces had participating in it, Nothing actually to do with General Ponish and myself. It was the participants that participated in this great program. Deset godina plodne saradnje sa Nacionalnom gardom Ohio jeste proizvod upornosti, mudrosti, stabilnosti i smišljenosti i velikog entuzijazma i vere u uspeh svih pripadnika Vojske Srbije i Nacionalne garde Ohio. Mogu biti i pripadnici Vojske Srbije i Ministarstva odbrane Srbije su izuzetno zadovoljni sa stepenom realizacije državnog partnerstva između Nacionalne garde Ohaja i Vojske Srbije. The future of the uh, state partnership program with our friends in Serbia, I think, is really limitless. There are so many opportunities and areas that we can move forward into. Obviously, next year in 2017, we're really looking forward and excited about the combined medical engagement, uh, the trilateral that we're going to be doing with Serbia and Angola. And I think that uh, will be probably one of the highlights of the year. But uh, there's a lot of other things that we look forward to doing with the Serbian military.